heading out of Talithea, going to near Smyrny, underneath the Sigru. A friend of mine is uh, opening a, an app or something to uh, help the cats in uh, Athens. This isn't really a hike, it's a walk. But uh, I didn't want to show you the brewing again, which I did this morning. Again with the cis rose, or sisters, or rock rose. Let's uh, see what my friend has to say about the cats in Athens. What's going on there? But I've also bought myself like a selfie stick. Let's hope that the videos will become smoother. So uh, this cat got run over by a car. And then the people took her to the hospital, got it uh, fixed and finally sterilized her as well. Bees, uh, what's the name of the cat? Tripod. 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 I think this is a cat with uh, just three legs. Hmm? Hello. Oh, it's quite nice. Oh. <laughs> This is again another litter of kittens open for adoption and the mother of these kittens is gonna get castrated or sterilized or whatnot and at the moment they're saying it's gonna cost 100 euro just to sterilize one cat but uh, I'm sure you can get it cheaper. So, yeah, the kittens are quite nice. That's there's a mother and uh, yeah, but there's so many here, so. That's why they need to get sterilized ASAP. So that's the last of that litter and hopefully we'll get adopted. And it's up on the tree. Come down, come down. And the mother is trying to help her somehow, but uh, I don't know if she comes down, but I think uh, small cats are, like even if it's falling now, it will just be, I think it will be fine. I don't know, I don't know. Cats are weird, weird creatures. No, I think they're coming down and uh, see when when they're sterilized then they have a whole different lifestyle because if they're not they get raped by two three cats all day long until they're pregnant and then the male cats know and and they leave them alone. Go on! Bravo then! The first trip up the tree and down. Safe landing.
So I think we're trying to follow the mother cat to lead us to the babies. Yeah, she moved them twice, so <laughs> you have to see where they moved it, you know. And they're big hopping around, so it's pretty safe down there. Okay, so we found the, the cats. We finally found the cats. They're jumping around here. There's another one down there, I think. Oh, yeah. Let me get the box, right? But it's not your kitten. Ah, there's three. Oh, hope I, I didn't scare them. Okay, now they're gone. Where is the mother? Ah, there's the mother. It's so strange because it's they're completely silent and uh, they're actually quite large, but you have to really, really look for them. Yeah, so I got this box. The mother knows us, but I'm gonna still wear some gloves. They were in this box before on the other side. The mother moved them here. Then they're in this house. But I still want them to have a blanket, you know. Our neighbors gave us this blanket. You know. Good mother. Nothing in the eyes, very healthy. There's one. Did you see the other ones, Alex? They go back under the box. Oh, they're behind the box. Oh, okay. See, it's very dirty behind the box. So how come they moved? You see here, this is very bad uh. for the eyes. They move because they're very curious. They're very healthy, very curious. And um, the mother moved them two times to be safe. She's a very good mother. And there's more. Yeah, we still have two more, but it's very, very, very dirty. Is that a cockroach? No. I hate cockroaches. <laughs> Where? <laughs> oh, it's a beetle. Yeah. Oh, okay. You Beetles see? are fine. So we don't want the babies to be behind there with the beetles. beetles. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I think in ancient Egypt they bring luck, but we don't need to try it. So this is what it's all about, you know. Of course, they're up for adoption. It's gonna take like one or two months, you know, when the mother is done breastfeeding. But just taking care of the babies, putting them in a box with a, with a nice blanket. We have food and water here. I do have to actively check on them because you can see they're always jumping out. Ah. Look at that, you see? So that's the problem, you know? No, no. Jesus, cat. Oh. There's the mo mother. She's chilling. Doing some German engineering, just. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, these babies are very. You filmed the first baby that's already grown when it got adopted. These babies are very strong, very. want to get out the box, you know. I've never seen that. So they're very, very healthy babies, thanks to the beautiful mother. So this is the concept of LARC, the mobile application I've uh, developed. This year I'm working on developing it. It's not all about adopting other cats, you know, because um, it's not the biggest solution. The solution is to take care of the cats, get the mother sterilized, get the knowledge of what to do, like this for example is perfect. And if nobody wants to adopt them, we'll sterilize them, and the best thing for cats is to be free. My buddy Alex, he's going to link my link. Please check out the concept and help support the application because this is what we can do to make the world step by step a better place.
Seriously, yeah. <laughs> no, no, but uh, it's good. All the uh, the cats in Athens. Um, like I've never seen so much dedication. Thank you. I'm just gonna get some powder for the fleas. You know, basic first aid like this um, powder against fleas. Just gonna put a little bit in there, and they'll run around. The mother will come breastfeed them. A little bit should be enough. Don't want to get it in their eyes. The mother licks them and cleans them, but it should be enough for them. Then they'll crawl around in it. If they were sick, we have antibiotics we can give them, but the most important thing is that it's a good mother taking care of them. And if they have people that care. Yeah. There's the mother. But she trusts us. If she wouldn't trust us, we wouldn't be able to go that close to her. Yeah. Maybe she would be like fighting us. <laughs> all that, so. You can also tell that this is a good environment. And if everybody does that in Athens, we wouldn't have a problem with the cats. You know? The sterilization, the, it, uh, apparently you can do it in Athens for free. I got two hours of hiking in. Met the catman of Alimos. I saw some kittens. Done.